These guys need to get a leader so they can get up there and get Nobody eat your carrot! The bitch! Yeah, we coming now. Welcome to Plantera. Um, I was sent this game from the publisher. Basically, you know, they requested that I try it out and you know put it on my channel so that way I can kind of demonstrate it to you guys. So we're gonna try it out. Looks like it could be fun. All right, so come on. You look so friendly. Whoa. Okay, so that's how I move. How do I move? Uh, let me try using the controller real quick. Um, okay, that's not working. <laughs> but then again, I I don't have a proper controller for Steam. So. Oh, I just click on stuff. That's how it goes. Okay. Well, how do I move? What's with the little arrow on the bottom? Right? Oh, so uh, okay. That's different. I don't see. You don't have enough coins. All right, so what do I do now? Do I? Do? Oh, okay. So I have to do certain things in order to progress. Oh, I get. Okay, so you're gonna. I want to kill the butterfly. Click on him. Oh. Oh. And then you harvest your carrot. Why did you drop it? Go pick that up, asshole. There you go. Now what can I get? Uh, uh, I, need, I need one more star to unlock that, I think. Uh-huh. So. Start picking carrots, motherfucker! Oh, nice. You don't have to pay for every carrot every time. No, I think as long as the plant's there, he'll just... Okay, he does it automatically. I don't even gotta tell him what to do. If anything, I was probably just making his life more difficult. Um... Let's, let's plant another one. Oh, I see. The, it, level 5. Level 5. Yeah. More or less, and it sounds like someone's trying to message me on Facebook. But they'll have- OH MY GOD, THERE'S A MOLE! KILL IT! Oh, you just click on him to kill him. Cool. <laughs> and, you, and you get stars for it. I like that. This is- You know, it's kind of nice to play a casual game. Instead of my rampant path of extreme hardcore, everything will kill you kind of frenzy. This is totally my kind of game since I've played so much Diner Dash and stuff. Right. Well, the great thing about this game is, like, it's very low spec. So, I mean, anyone can play it on any platform or computer or whatever. And I think it's only, like, three bucks. So, and it'll definitely keep you entertained if you just, you know board got nothing better to do or if it's just one of those things that um that interests you in general all right can i unlock this i got 23 stars how do i use them no i think it needs to be level five instead of 25 coins oh so we'll just keep planting shit that's what we'll do god look at him he's just like fuck dude <laughs> he looks like kind of unhappy with his life all right I wonder if they would put in like a competitive mode, like that would make a lot more interest in this like competitive multiplayer or something. Kind of like Dr. Mario style where you split the screen in half, you got one player on one side, one on the other, and you just gotta get away from me! I don't care. He's a dick. He probably wants to come eat my carrots, but fuck it, and I gotta turn these carrots into gold. That's what Jesus would do. <laughs> I wonder what the butterflies have a purpose for. Oh, I can kill them! Oh, they're money! I can kill them! Excellent, get out of here! Oh! You have another helper! Cool! I'm a slave runner! <laughs> Whoa! A sphincter just bubbles. opened up in the ground and a poopy came out! Ah! Go away, butterfly! Oh! Oh, maybe you can only click them when they're glowing. Maybe. I think that's- maybe that's just like... 
an unkillable NPC with no importance, but all the importance at the same time. Right. He's just there to annoy you. Kind of like, what's her name? The fairy from fucking Zelda. Oh. Uh, yeah. Navi? Yeah. That bitch. <laughs> Alright guys, more work for you. So I know how much you guys love to work. I mean, that's basically two workers for two fields, so... Good shit. Get out of here. Oh my god, I just killed Navi! <laughs> I just accomplished like every fucking gamer's dream. Get out of here! Get out of here! Did you ever have that crazy neighbor that was like, Get off my lawn! Kind of like, Get off my lawn! <laughs> yes. Fucking Clint Eastwood status pulls out a shotgun. <laughs> I wish I had one of those neighbors growing up. That would have been badass. Cause that would be like the neighbor that you're like, dude, he's crazy as fuck, but he's probably got a lot of cool shit to teach you. I'm just gonna pop these out of the ground so that way more can grow. You can't keep up with all your magnificent, magnificent Hey! Pop. Oh, I can click out of myself. Fuck the money! Fucker. You don't belong! Oh, I just reached level four. Get out of here, motherfucker! Just... So, I mean, I suppose I could help. And, you know, just do this myself, but then what would have been the point of enslaving these fuckers to begin with? For a second, I thought that the bag was, like, a hood-type thing he was wearing. Fucker. But... Piece of shit. <laughs> I mean, this is just really a nice little casual game. Like, there's no real complications so far. So, I mean, I'll probably rate it, like, probably 6 or 7 out of 10. Just because, I mean, it's thoroughly addictive, as you can see, so I'll probably never play it again. Just because it'll distract me from, you know, the content that I put on my channel. I would play this. I know you would. I would play this until... It became depressing in my life. Well, I'll share it with you on Steam. That is nice. And then you can hop on your laptop and play it all you want. This is just... It's so simplistic. It's motherfucker. And that's like, <laughs> that's my real interest, is I can slap bunnies. <laughs> and kill butterflies. I mean, I'm a sadistic motherfucker. There's a mole! Get out of here, you goddamn Russian motherfucker. <laughs> Trying to spy on my country. So, how do I know when I've reached the next level? Oh, I can click on other things. Oh, you could have planted a tree. I can plant a tree. Nice. Fucking... Yeah, there we go. Then we'll get a cherry tree. Um, I like to pick up chicks, so... <laughs> Probably grow more produce. Yeah, it looks pretty good so far. I like it. Get out of here. Oh my god! Look at all this. Get those cherries. Get those blueberries. I fucking love blueberries. Y'all don't even know. Y'all don't even know how much I love blueberries. Especially the fucking blueberry lemonade meal drink. Y'all gotta try that shit. I love you, Mio. Sponsor me. <laughs> Get out of here! Get like out of here! Oh my god! That one's a little more cool. Well, it's nice that they do throw in some enemies and difficulty into this. Otherwise, I would get so bored so fast. I do know. Woo! We did it! Oh, you know what that means. Can get something other than carrots. Oh, there's a bug. Oh, he's worth so much money! Oh. Now we've hit level 5, so... Let's do level 5 thing. Um, destroy that. I wanna grow beets! I think it did switch it out. Um, I don't feel like it did. Well, how do I get out of this thing? Let me out! Motherfuckers are trying to attack my lawn! Oh, do you have to... Trash one of the carrots? Maybe. Oh wait, you do have an open slab on the far left. Look. 
No? No, no, on the way, way left. Oh, cool. Oh god, I can't manage that though. Block! It's gonna do so much screen scrolling. These guys need to get a leader so they can get up there and <gasps> the get That bunny the... ate your carrot! The bitch! I really want to know what the chicken does. This is really bothering me. Like... Maybe he just... Oh, oh he does poop. shit eggs! Cool! He just pooped all over my lawn creating fertilizer! Uh, I like how the birds that fall from the sky have the same flight pattern as, like, duck hunt. Right? <laughs> Fucking y'all are slick. What, how do I get more helpers? Like, did because he just like crawled out of nowhere. I didn't even like click on him. Um. Get out of here. Fucking birds. Poop. I like the sound it makes when it poops. Right. <laughs> like ah, my sphincter. Are helpers in your menu? Funny. No, I didn't see him. I mean, they might be, but I didn't see him. Uh, let's see. Jesus. Okay. I can get a guard dog. I don't, I don't have, have any money. money. I will have the money after I kill more animals. <laughs> Fuck out of my yard. Right? My exact uh, not exact. I'm helping. <laughs> Can you imagine how hard this game would be without a mouse? Just a trackpad? Oh, those those eggs are worth quite a bit too. Uh-huh. I will. I'm just gonna save up for a dog. I'm not gonna cash out of anything else just yet. Because I have a feeling that the dogs will help ward off like animals and shit. That would be really helpful. Woo! Oh, I think you get another helper now. Cool! There you go. So it'll just... Every so level so often. So maybe it's like every other level. Fucking beetles. What? Well, no! I don't... Expand. No, I don't! I'm sitting up for a fucking dog. What's wrong with you? Can't you see I have enough trouble keeping up with this shit on its own? Dicks. Only planting gardens like this just created money on their own in real life. Right. But no, you gotta be a real farmer. Mm -hmm. I almost got paranoid when I saw the fucking other helper coming from the left side there. <laughs> I was supposed to be like, bitch, I will smack you. <laughs> I'll smack you until you're a darker shade of blue. Fuck it, I'll smack you purple. <laughs> cherries grow so quickly. Fucking God, bunnies. Like every God, animal. dude, I wish it was so easy to smack birds like that in real life. Right. Or bunnies for that. Well, the bunnies in our yard. Because they don't go anywhere. That's like, true. seriously, the fucking rabbit population has gotten, like, so retarded. Like, you'll go out there and try to chase them. Why well, you can get within, like, not even a foot of them before they move, and they only ponder, like, a foot or two. Oh, my God. Or, like, when I'm driving home at night, it'll be... There'll be like three bunnies in the road. I will be centimeters from hitting them with my vehicle, and they don't give a crap. Nope. They're like, uh, you realize it's our mating season, right? We'll do what we want. There's only 18 billion of us, so don't hit me. Bunnies are stupid. <laughs> it's like, people think they're so cute. It's like, they're basically giant rats with ears. They are rodents. You gotta smack them. You just, every time you see a bunny, you guys, you gotta smack them. Do it in the name of all the hyeniacs all over the world. The dozens and dozens of them. I wonder what that thing is supposed to be. A fox? Maybe. A really fat fox. <laughs> it's like probably me. a fire fox. I mean, look how rotund that chicken is. Right? <laughs> Oh my god, we're almost, uh, we're at like 750 gold. You only need like 250 more. I think I'm gonna start planting more blueberry bushes. 
just because they do grow rabbit quickly and they'll fall out on their own. Mm -hmm. As compared to the apples I got on fucking take on your own. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's a scarecrow for... Ooh, what's this? Strawberries? Probably. Oh, I fucking love strawberries. I know you do. Making these guys... Oh, the apples do eventually fall on their own. That's good. It's just more conventional taking myself. <laughs> <laughs> just smack that guy. That was beautiful. Smack that bitch up. Strawberries are worth two gold pieces. That's fuck it. Let's get one more of those. This is a very prosperous garden. Ooh, an egg. So then there's is there three levels? So you could in theory do I'm not sure like how far this game goes, but I'm having a lot more fun than I expected. Like, it's horribly addicting. Just horribly addicting. <laughs> but, well, and part of me wants to be like, oh, well, I just turn off the sound of the game and play my own music, but I like the pooping sound too much. You know, when I heard the name Plantera, I was almost expecting there to be a little bit of metal in this. Just because of the name and, you know, the connection to Pantera. But, you know what? It's still enjoyable. It's still fun. I mean, this is gonna be boring as fuck, probably to uh, a lot of people watching. But fuck, dude. I actually recommend trying this game. I honestly do. I feel like this would be a feel-good game, like if you're playing Demon Souls and you just get raped. Well, that's the thing too, and that's why it's nice to kind of take a break and play this as compared to my usual hardcore gaming. Right. Or even fucking Doom, because once you get to the fourth chapter of Doom, it gets fuck more intense, and you really have to change up your usual strategy rather than just run and gun. Because here's the thing with that. The fourth episode of Doom was not originally produced or made with the actual game. It actually came out after it really hit like its peak popularity, and everyone's like, make it harder. Huh. Exactly, so... It's pretty much an, a hardcore expansion, is what it is. Fucking get out of here! Guess what? Hmm. You can afford the dog now. Oh my god! Oh my dog! Where is it? Where is it? Yes! Get him, Poochie! <laughs> I can't tell if he looks more like a grizzly bear or a dog. Both. He is all of the above. He's a warrior. Look at him. I know! <laughs> I'm gonna name him Fart Nugget. <laughs> That's a great name. I know. Actually, no. I'll name him Beefcake. <laughs> Get him, Beefcake. Show him his boss. I mean, I know I'm taking like all the kills from you, but I, I'm sorry, I've gotten used to it. I'm not used to having a best friend. Get out of here, fuckers. Probably get another. I was trying to kill my own fucking chick. <laughs> probably get another bush and put up over here. Just. Why not? Fucker! I have just enough for another strawberry peel. Do you have another big tree? I probably could get one, but I don't want to. What the fuck, dog? There was a mole right in front of your. Oh, he did get rid of me. Probably tongued it to death. Probably. Oh, he chases off the bunny. See that shit? Yeah, he just barked at it. Oh my god, he... I gotta save up and get another dog. No wonder why crazy farm people have so many dogs. Right? <laughs> Fucking yeah, you get him. <laughs> Good job, beefcake. I love you. <laughs> this is way too fucking addicting. I'm gonna have to stop playing soon. I'm not going to be able to wait until I get another dog because that's going to be another $2,000. So, I think if anything I'm just going to leave off here. Can you save? Um, I know what auto saves. So, 
keep an eye out on the left hand corner because I'm pretty Oh there we go, it's auto saving right now. Oh nice. Cool, so alright guys, this is Plantera. Um definitely fun, very addictive as you can see. It's a really nice chill game. Uh check it out on Steam. I don't know if it's on any other platforms, but you can always look for it. So with that my high axe, I'm gonna end this episode. I'm gonna Yeah. yeah. How do I Oh, okay, here we go. There we go. So, cool. Alright, my hiney X, I love you, and I'll see you guys later. Bye! Hey guys, Iron Popcan here. I just wanted to say thank you all for watching our videos and supporting us. Um, I just want to do a quick shout out to um, one of my favorite places here in Salt St. Paul called Level Up Games. As you can see, you know, they do have an official website. You can order from them. Um, I just want to do this like you know I'm not officially sponsored by them but they have been awesome enough to you know hook me up with some stuff and they have put you know flyers for our page all over their stores so I mean I really appreciate that and I want to you know help get them out there because they do they like have a great selection on video games from you know the new gen all the way back to like NES Atari and everything in between um, probably the biggest pop uh, figure collection I have ever laid my eyes upon. I mean, we got over 14 pops, and I would say at least the vast majority, at least three-fourths of them have come from them. They're very rare, very hard to find, as well as, if you guys have seen um, the Hyena Den video, you also seen the um, Deadpool figurine, which is very rare, very hard to find, also from there, as well as that little X-Pac figure. So, I mean, they are just... They're a great collection of gems, as you can see in the pictures here, and I'll show you some of the stuff. I mean, they're huge on trading card games as well, board games. They have tournaments almost every weekend, and just, that's only half of their store. I mean, you don't even see the other half where they have all the video games and just everything else. Um, comics, um, even today, like, they do this frequent thing where they actually have free comic book day, as you can see. Um, they have it going on today, so if any of you are in the St. Paul area and you just want to go check it out, yeah, I mean, you can get up to free, uh, 10 free comics at once. So, I just want to help them get their name out there. I'll put a link down to their website um, and everything else, you know, their social media and all that stuff. Either way, guys, you know, just, I want to say thank you to them and thank you to all of you as well. Um, I really appreciate it. Um, I love you, my hyenaniacs, and I'll see you guys later.